I like to walk around in silence, because that's when songs come into my head. I want to make enough money to run my life from the top of a mountain. A lot of people compare me to like a mix of Joni Mitchell and PJ Harvey, like grittier, raw sound with like this kind of classic songwriting. I, got I think I'm inspired by just various events that happen in my life, usually revolving around love, loss, longing, loneliness, uh, abandonment issues. <laughs> it's like, wow, you are really, really pathetic today. Write that song. <laughs> sure you want to write that song? Even young, you tell me lots of stories about when I was old. And I wasn't too much fun then from all the stories I've been told. Now I got what I want and I got what I need and there's nothing. I really like singing on commercials. It's really fun. You get to sing about meat and stuff. He's juicy, he's crispy, he looks just like his brother. Like that was... <laughs> I'm telling you, I've sung some really fun stuff. I have some projects I'm working on right now that, that sort of show my um, quirky, humorous, bizarre side of songwriting. At some point, if I decide that I want to back off on the artist career, I think maybe I'll start writing ads for like McDonald's and Wendy's. I want to replace all of your memories. When you close your eyes, you see only me someday. Someday. Up on the mountain, I can hold your hand. Every place has a different vibe, you know. My favorite place to go in LA is the beach. I just like to walk on the beach by myself, you know, in the morning at like 7 a.m. Venice is my hood. It's always my favorite part of LA. It's the beauty and it's also the grit. I love it. The whole mix of it is just so crazy to me. And I like that. I like stuff that's just random and bizarre. In this world you me. Thanks for watching me on In the Mo and be sure to check out my recommendations.